Hey everybody, this is Dion and uh, today I just realized that uh, Nintendo is posting a lot of new stuff so perhaps a lot of them rumors will be uh, definitely be answered so if they are coming out or not I saw some news uh, you know like uh, a new Game & Watch, new uh, celebration of the 35th uh, Mario Bros uh, anniversary and uh, Super Mario Land 3D so let's start with this one There you go. This is so funny because just yesterday I was speaking to somebody and saying, you know, uh, that is the only original game that's on the Wii U that they still haven't ported to the Switch. I have never played this one as well, you know, and I keep repeating that on my other videos like Mario 64, uh, Super Mario Sunshine, even Mario Galaxy 1 and 2, I have never played them. Uh, seen a lot of videos, seen a lot of documentaries about it how revolutionizing uh, they were for their time uh, and how they shaped the video game, you know, the, the video game industry in a way You can feel that, I don't know if you're like, if it's a bossa nova music style um, that they are using, you know, in this game and in uh, Super Mario Odyssey like this big band sound It's really comforting and it, and it uh, probably has a large appeal, like everybody, different ages, uh, different ethnicities, you know, it's something that feels good listening to it. I got in touch, you know, playing this Super Mario uh, 3D World, I mean that cat, when I was experience, experiencing uh, Super Mario Maker 2 for the first time. That's the first time where I actually experienced the cat mechanics. So this is the new part, so this part is not on the Wii U and on the 3DS for that, for that matter. Bowser's, Bowser's Furry. Whoa, okay, save it for next year. <laughs> Guys, let me know in the comments down below what you think about this. Uh, Anyway, uh, yeah, well, I, I, I've not, I have never played this one on the Wii U, even though I actually own it, you know, I've been postponing it, like, it's not the right time, it's not the right time right now, and I, you always get this feeling like, so when is the right time to play that on a damn channel? <laughs> you know, because these games keep on, on popping out, and you're like, okay, maybe you try to play the new one, and then save that one for afterwards, and then it never happened, so I, I gotta figure that out. Uh, let me know in the comments down below what you think about this game, for those of you that played it on the 3DS or on the Wii U. For those of you that have never played it, but own oh, no, a Switch, will you be getting this game? And uh, uh, judging from, you know, unfortunately the current situation in the world because of the the damn virus. Um, for them, it's actually, actually, remasters, ports, um, collections. Uh, it's, it's an excellent time to put that out because people will buy it regardless. And if, it's, it, if you put in the timeless aspect of it, because it's considered a classic for some reason, right? Um, you know, people will buy it. And the Switch has already uh, a considerable installment base so that can only play you know in favor uh, for nintendo releasing like let, let's let's do a, a quick recap i have not reacted on that one yet but i know pigment 3 uh a deluxe version is also apart from the wii u came out uh, animal crossing who would have thought that it would be you know such a big success and again i think the current situation uh, help help that or how should i say I don't feel comfortable using that word help that uh, using a pandemic or a virus crisis or whatever, you know, it just didn't feel right. But, you know, uh, it's a consequence that helped uh, in a way for that to happen because people are on, you know, on the indoors and want to play something. And uh, yeah, there's another game that I have never played. I've never played any game from that franchise as well. Paper Mario just came out. I just yesterday I uploaded the first Let's Play video about that. 
What else? Well, for that matter, you know, the previous installment of Paper Mario has not been released on a, on a Switch, but I actually own that one on the Wii U. Uh, what else? I think I'm forgetting something. That I, I'm quite sure that I'm forgetting one game, but... What else? Think, think, think. <laughs> Give me some mushrooms and some, some star power now, because I, I need it. Uh, anyway, it will come to me, you know, after I posted the video anyways, and then I'll be pissed off because of it. But, you know, it's, it is what it is. Um, I'm seeing here, there's a new, I don't know if it's recent or not, uh, Super Mario Maker 2, I think they, they, the last update came in the beginning of this year, I'm, I'm guessing. Um, well, I think that's about it. You, 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 I think they were holding back on, I don't know what, what's happening with Bayonetta 3, which is an exclusive. I don't know what's happening with the Metroid uh, trilogy. Well, supposedly it's it's been reworked. Um, maybe they will be releasing those games after the PlayStation 5 and the new Xbox, you know, eventually got to the market. Uh, it's just a wild guess, but okay. So, other rumors that I think will be answered right now because I see them in the suggestion box uh, below. Um, over here, <laughs> you act, they actually made a direct, you know, and, and look at this. Super Mario 3D All-Stars announcement trailer. This has been going on for so long as a rumor. And people, you know, wanted something like um, the Super Mario All-Stars that came out for the Super Nintendo back in those days and eventually got ported to the Wii. I think it was on the 25th celebration of uh, Super Mario, something like that. Um, so now it's the 35th. This is, that is crazy. So, uh, I will be reacting to those trailers right now. I'm anxious to know. You know, I feel like a little kid because it really excites me. Who would have thought? And, I, and again, I've never played those games. Uh, I never did. <laughs> I keep thinking, well, I just, you know, download an emulator and try it out for the first time. Because a lot of people actually, who, who did not experience that in real time, when these games came out, experience it on emulators or buy it. You know, things like... Uh, the virtual console, if you actually, you know, went that way, um, or ports on other machines. Um, but you know, if somebody can't pay it, can't pay the game right away. You know, that's their first experience. It's it's going to be on an emulation uh, program. So it's good that they. I, I hope it's a remaster and not just a, a simple plain port. But um, okay, I'm talking way too much. I gotta go. Thank you for watching and comment me down below. Subscribe if you like my content. You know, I will be playing, um, you know, uh, more games. Uh, yesterday, uh, Paper Mario went up and keep on coming back because for the rest of the week, I will be posting more stuff. So thank you for watching and goodbye. Have a nice day. <laughs> if you won't have a nice day after these announcements, I don't know what's wrong with you, okay? Goodbye. <laughs>